Earpiece in. Let's rock. Convert as directed. Part A, 3 minus 3i to trigonometric form. What form is it currently in? Standard. Large print edition. For those of you that like to sit far away from your computers. So this problem, what's A? What's B? What other letter do we need? R. R is the square root of A squared plus B squared. That sound means there's only five minutes left in the round. What is the square root of three squared plus the quantity negative three squared? 18. Square root of 18 cleans up as three square roots of two. So according to our formulas, the cosine of theta is a over r. R a is three, r r is three radical two. Both of the threes are outside, so they can play together. What happens to them? They cancel, so you get one over the square root of two. One over the square root of two can be rewritten as radical two over two. Ha! Ah, sine of theta is b over r is negative three over three square roots of two. Notice the only difference is this one's negative, so we're going to end up with negative radical 2 over 2. What angle has a cosine value of positive radical 2 over 2 and a sine value of negative radical 2 over 2? 315 degrees. You can use either degrees or radians. It does not matter. So in order to write a trigonometric, I lied. In order to write a complex number in trigonometric form, all you need is an r and a theta. We found our r to be 3 radical 2. We just found our theta to be 315 degrees. So 3 minus 3i, which is in standard form, is the same thing as r, 3 radical 2, times the cosine of r theta, which is 315 degrees, plus i times the sine of r theta, the same 315 degrees. boo ba da ba da Extra credit if you know where that's from. Extra credit received. The Sims. When your sim is just sitting there, he might sing, or she might sing. Over there, yeah, when the shower. My shuno, it's grout, it's fresh hour. Habana, bana, habana, bana. That's when they're comforting someone. Habana, bana, habana, bana. I'm so keeping all that in. Negative five I convert to trig form. We need an A. A B, an R, and a theta. Careful. So R would be the square root of 0 squared plus negative 5 squared. Okay, we're going to move a little bit faster. The cosine of theta is A over R. So in this case it would be 0 over 5, which in most countries is The sine of theta is b over r, so negative 5 over 5 is. So what angle theta has a cosine value of 0 and a sine value of negative 1? 270 degrees. Good. So the last line in both columns is all we need besides love. So negative 5i, which is in standard form, is what in trigonometric form? Five times the quantity
Fantastic comments. I mean, negative 5i, if you're to graph it, is 5 units down on the y-axis. Right? Okay. Well, how far is this point from the origin? And what angle would be necessary to go from here to the negative y-axis? 270 or 3 pi over 2. Hey, we didn't need any of these formulas. We could have just drawn a picture to find our r and our theta. Wah, wah. My bad.